My car is now the third car which this turbo is going inside. I actually cannot rev this car too much or else it'll do, it'll go into some sort of a limp mode so So welcome back to Project Octavia and this is episode 2 technically because in the first episode we were fixing the coolant leak that the Octi had and in this episode we're actually going to be fitting an IS20 turbo and a performance down So in this episode we're going to be fitting an IS20 turbo and a performance down pipe to the car So right now the car is on the lift I've removed the wheels because I've actually already installed the new wheels don't want to reveal them in this video I'll do that in the next one So today it's all about removing parts uh, kicking out the IS12 turbo which is stock in this car and putting in a bigger IS20 with a performance down pipe I want to see how the car sounds at the end and let's get cracking So what is going on right now is we're removing all of the oil lines, coolant lines, and all other necessary stuff to basically reach the turbo. Uh, so that's what basically Manoj Bhaiya is doing right now. And after that, will the turbo is basically at the back of the engine, so it's very hard to you know like reach it. Uh, if you remember the 1.2 TSI, the turbo is literally up front, right near the grill. So very easy job, just a couple of screws, couple of things here and there, and the turbo was basically in your hand. but this is def much more difficult uh, a very tight and a very tiny space also to put your hands in so you have to remove quite a lot of things in order to get access to that area and yeah i'll just quickly go and bring the turbo so i can show it to you guys and once the is12 is out we can show like a little comparison as to what are the differences and yeah then we'll start fitting the is20 so this box over here has my new turbo and it's right over here pretty heavy This is an IS20 turbo and little story time this turbo has been in uh, two different cars in the past my car is now the third car which this turbo is going inside and those two other cars that i'm talking about have already been featured on the channel so if you remember in 2020 or 2021 we covered this black octavia vrs245 stage 2 that was mechanics's old car and that car basically came with this turbo charger stock from the factory After that the turbo was removed and sold to a Octavia 1.8 owner in Bombay and we've actually covered that car as well an IS20 Octavia 1.8 just like mine and now that car has a DQ381 transmission with a Garrett Powermax turbo the first in the country i'm not sure if that video has come out at the time of posting this one but this is now the third uh, car that this turbo is going to go inside and yeah pretty cool and This is the performance downpipe. Uh yeah, looks pretty complicated and I think so this has been made by Automac. Probably I'll change to an IES stainless steel system in the very near future. So, let's see how it works out for the time being and I really want to see how it sounds with a performance downpipe. So unfortunately we came to the office a little late today and these guys have already fitted a couple of the parts I mean they fitted the main part actually this over here is my old IS12 turbo and the bigger turbo is actually already inside I don't know if you can see it but yeah now they're in the process of installing the downpipe This is the old one. This is the new one. As you can see, it doesn't have that big uh, area over here like that. Of course, much more lighter, made out of stainless steel. Uh, this will be much heavier also. So hopefully, that will make a difference in the sound as well. So yeah, let's see what's next.
So the downpipe is now in. You just have to do up the bolts and all of that stuff. So more or less the turbo and the downpipe are now in. And yeah, like I was saying, this is a VRS245 exhaust system. So as you can see at the rear, it splits up and it has two real exhaust outlets with mufflers. So that's one. The other one is right there. And yeah, almost done with the downpipe and the turbo. Okay, so the car is completely done, new turbo, new downpipe, everything is done. So now, Manoj bhaiya, karu chalu. Okay, okay. So we'll be just adding some coolant and water uh, into the reservoir and after that we'll start the car and let's see how it sounds. Okay, so moment of truth. Now I need to start the car and somehow get into it as well. So I think so that's it for this video. I actually cannot rev this car too much because first of all, I don't have any wheels on the car. So it's throwing a lot of errors on the dash. And apart from that, uh, you need a tune to run an IS20 under downpipe on this car or else it'll, do, it'll go into some sort of a limp mode. So not going to be risking any of that just by a couple of revs. So in the next episode, we're actually going to be fitting the brakes and the new wheels for this car. And actually they're right over here, but you just can't see them at the moment. So stay tuned for that episode and I'll catch you in the next one.